Okay, this is a compression test on the new red 2000 Nissan Xterra SE. We're doing cylinder number one. We're suspecting there's a blown head gasket. We're just not sure what cylinder it is or could be multiple cylinders. Here we go, cylinder number one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This looks like about 157 and a half. Not bad. Cylinder number four. Still expect we're gonna find a low number, probably on cylinder number six. Because there was some wetness on that spark plug. That one's low too. Looks like about 135. Okay. Cylinder number six, the last cylinder. A little low as well. Looks like 145. Okay. I am compression testing this JDM engine that I purchased. I have, if I actually bolted on the transmission to the engine, uh, I just basically installed the flywheel and hooked the transmission up to it just so I had access to the plate that is necessary to bolt the starter on. So I have the starter on, I have rigged up an electrical system via my little battery charger. And I have removed all the spark plugs and I've got the compression tester in cylinder number one. Zero that all out. Over here, I'll flip the switch. One, two, three, four, five, six. six revs at this current should be enough. And looks like we have, turn the light off here. 155 PSI on cylinder number one, and we'll check the rest and see if they are the same. This is a retest since this engine appears to have low and erratic pressure in a handful of the cylinders. We're going to redo this just to make sure we're not wrong. Okay, just making sure throttle cable is pulled tight so we know the throttle's open. Cylinder number one zeroed out. Let's kick the power. Oh, we need to plug it in. Safety precautions. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. And that looks like about 157 and a half. A couple pounds up from last time, but we went a couple of revs over to went eight revs. Cylinder number six, the last cylinder. So far, all the other cylinders are equalizing all around 170. This is after running the motor for several minutes with spark plugs in, oil in all the cylinders, and just using the starter. This is the last one. We are fingers crossed, hoping to get something around 170. about 169 perfect showing the leaky valve stem seals in here see if you can see that in there there you go it's all nasty <laughs>